hello everyone welcome back to tech cloud channel hope you have subscribed to the channel if not yet please subscribe and do not miss any video okay so in today's video we are going to discuss about what is message digest benefit of message digest types of hash function and examples so let's first understand what is message digest a message digest also known as hash value or hash code is a fixed size string of a characters generated by a hash function this function takes an input like message or data of any size and produces a unique fixed length output which serves as a digital fingerprint for the output now let's understand the benefit of message digest like it has the fixed length so message digest always have a fixed length regardless of the size of the input for example, the SAR-256 algorithm produces a 256 bit of hash only. There we have irreversibility. So the process is designed to be one way, making it computationally infeasible to reverse the hash and obtain the original input. Means it cannot be reversed when it is hashed. Now deterministic. For the same input, the hash function will always produce the same message digest. So this deterministic nature ensure consistency. Then collision resistance. A good hash function minimizes the chance of the two different input producing the same hash, a collision. This is crucial for data integrity. Now let's understand the types of hash in message digest. At first we have MD5 message digest algorithm 5 which produces 128 bit hash value and not recommended for cryptographic security due to vulnerabilities. Then SA1 secure hash algorithm 1 it produces a 160 bit hash value depreciated for cryptographic use due to vulnerability also. Then we have SA256 which is secure hash algorithm 256 so it part of it's a family part of SA2 and it produces a 256 bit of hash value. It is widely used for cryptographic application nowadays. Then SA3 which is a secure hash algorithm version 3. So the latest member of the secure hash algorithm and then also it provide hash value with the various length of 224, 256, 384 and 512 bits. Then we have Wolfool. It is a cryptographic hash function also that produces a 512 bit of hash value and used for the various security application mostly. Later we have the Blake 2. It is a high speed cryptographic hash function known for its simplicity and efficiency. It is available in two versions which is Blake 2B and Blake 2S. Blake 2B is 64 bit platform and Blake 2S is the 32 bit platform. Then we have Ribbed 160. RIBD 160 means race integrity primitive evaluation message digest. It is it produces 160 bit hash value and it used in the blockchain technology including even Bitcoin. Then the tiger. So this tiger has algorithm produces 192 bit of hash value and it is also known for its efficiency and simplicity. Then we have Willwind which is which was developed by new europe scheme for signature integrity and encryption and it produces a hash value of the varial length then we have ghost r ghost r 34 11 2012 it is the russian cryptographic hash function standard and it's a part of russian cryptographic standards skin so the one of the it is one of the sa3 finalist also designed to be efficient and secure it offers function of various output sizes then murmur has so this has is a non cryptographic hash function known for its speed and simplicity commonly it is being used in application like hash table and data structure hashing so these are the types of hash or message digest let's now understand as an example so here on the screen we can see we have original message as hello world and the hash function where we are using SAR256 hash algorithm so once a 
message or a data is hashed it can be we can simply say it can be converted in a unreadable format unreadable format or unreversible format think of it like your package has a tracking number like a message digest uniquely identifies your package during its journey providing a secure and irreversible means of tracking its status so this is all about message digest and i hope this video is helpful for you please do like comment share and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching see you in the next video